welcome back guys so this is question number 12 and previously we have solved part a of this question today we are going to solve part b of it and also part c okay so what is part b here so in part b we have a b c prime d prime okay plus d e prime f plus a f whole prime and this is equal to x and what are we asked to do we have to use nand gates nor gates or combination of both to implement the logic uh, expression which has been given here okay so first of all let me see that how many inputs do i have so here i have a b c d e f uh, here so let me write them here and for it i'm going to use this color so i have a b c d e and f okay so these are the inputs we have and writing or drawing the input lines from here okay so here we have first of all let me implement this one and writing this one uh, what i have to do first of all i have to multiply these four terms and before multiplying them what i have to do i have to take the complement of c and d okay so uh, therefore let me first uh, use this nand gate okay with it and giving this to it what i will get i will get here c complement okay similarly another nand gate okay this will have two inputs combining these two inputs and giving this to this one what i will get here i will get here d complement okay so now as uh, we have got these uh, all so let me use another nand gate here with four inputs so okay so one two three four okay so to these four inputs let me give first a then b then okay then c complement to this one and also to this let me give this d complement or uh, let me draw them here as well so this is d complement and at the output of it what i will get i will get a b c complement d complement and the whole complement of it and in order to remove this whole complement what i have to do i have to use another inverter here and this inverter will also be the nand gate with two inputs connected together and at the output of it what i will get i will get a b c complement d complement okay so this is the first term which i had to find out similarly now what i have to do i have to find out this second product and that is d e complement f okay so uh, first of all let me complement this uh, e as well so complementing this e using this nand gate with the two inputs combined together so therefore here i will get this e complement and after it as i have d e complement f so let me use here another nand gate okay sorry let me use it here so here this nand gate okay and with this uh, let me have these three inputs and here i will have this d okay so let me use this d here okay this is d given to it and uh, to the second input let me give this e complement and to the third let me give this f so at the output of it what i will get i will get d e complement f with the whole complement and in order to remove this whole complement what i have to do i have to use another gate or nand gate here to which i have to apply this input and at the output of it what i will get i will get here d e complement f okay so this is the <clears throat> second part which i have here Similarly, now in order to implement this 
third product which is AF whole complement. So what I have to do, I have to use the NAND get here and the simple inputting the inputs A and F to it, but I will get my answer. So let me get this NAND gate to this. I have two inputs. Okay, one will be the A and the second will be the F. So this will be A here. This is A while this will be the F. Okay, so at the output of it, what I will get, I will get here A, F whole complement. Okay. At the end, what I have to do, I have to add them together. So therefore, let me use the NAND gate because, sorry, the NOR gate because I cannot use uh, other than NAND and NOR gate. So let me use the three input NOR gate and to them let me apply the inputs. Okay, so at the output of it, what I will get, I will get here A, B, C complement, D complement plus B, E complement, F plus A, F whole complement and the whole complement of it. What I have to do? I have to remove this whole complement. So therefore, let me use another NOR gate. Okay. I can also use here the NAND gate as well. But here, let me use this NOR gate. And to this NOR gate, let me apply the same input. Okay. So at the output of it, what I will get, this uh, complement will be removed. Okay, and at the output of it, what I will get, I will get A, B, C complement, D complement plus D, E complement, F plus A, F whole complement. Okay, so this is what this is X, and that is the answer of my question which I had to find out here okay so that is the solution of uh, part b here uh, similarly you can also use the same procedure to find the solution of part c here as well so i am giving it for uh, this uh, part c for your own uh, practice here and i am not solving it but this is the solution you have to uh, perform the same steps I have performed here. Uh, if you want to uh, invert any input, what you can do, you can either use the NAND gate or NOR gate with the two or three inputs combined together, then the same input will be applied. And uh, similarly, the other gates will also be implemented uh, by deploying the same methods which we have previously covered in our introductory video of the NAND and NOR equivalent gates. Okay. So I think it's enough for today and I will see you with some more interesting questions in our upcoming video. Take care of yourself and I will see you soon.